How's it going guys? One of the biggest battles with 3D printing is getting the first layer to stick to your print bed. And there are a lot of tricks that you can do. I have experimented with a lot of stuff. Um, and so I'll just share a couple with you real quick. The, uh, a lot of people print with PLA, which is great because it doesn't warp very much when the temperature changes. And so it makes it stick to a lot of stuff. Um, but if you're printing with PETG or ABS, those both have issues with sticking to things. Um, I find that ABS is the hardest to print with because it does not like to stick. This is PETG that I'm printing with right now. And I've got it on this blue painter's tape. It's just this duct tape. Um, and this does great for me. I can print on this um, honestly for several days, like literally 24 seven. Uh, and it, I can keep popping it off and just print another one on it and it does great. Uh, so that works really nicely for the PETG. Um, another, and then over here I have it uh, on, these are both glass print beds by the way, I just have glass on top of it and that makes it flat and the tape sticks very nicely to this glass where it does not stick to the bed itself very well. So over here I have PETG um, printing on the glass bed and I use hairspray to get it to stick to the bed and that works really nicely as well. But when you have a larger base that is sticking uh, to that you're printing to the bed, you have a hard time getting it off unless you turn off the heat so that you can then pop it off because it allows it to uh, just make a clean, I guess, release. I don't know. It, uh, I guess, the when it cools the glass and the print itself shrink at a slightly different rate and so it allows it to uh, detach pretty easily. Anyway, maybe I'll make some other videos about ABS uh, tomorrow or in a few days because I'm already over my time limit that I usually like to do for videos, but there you go for PETG. Um, make sure you leave a thumbs up. It really helps me out and I do appreciate it a lot. And uh, subscribe for the future videos. I'll talk about ABS a little bit more tomorrow. So thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.